Hi, I'm Amy and this is film four of five in our How to Open School series. And if the first three films considered the big picture and outlining of your open schooling project, in this film I'm going to talk you through detailed planning. Before we start, just a note on the language used. Make It Open works with what we've called learning scenarios, which is equivalent to a scheme of work or a project incorporating learning units, which equate to lesson plans. You'll see these terms used within the planning tool that we've created called the Open Schooling Navigator. The Navigator is both a resource and a design tool. You can use it for inspiration. Currently, you can see there are 16 example learning scenarios which engage with the natural environment, health, climate and more. Each learning scenario is broken down into phases, from brief, to research, to create and share. Let's have a look at one in detail. Here we're looking at one of the tried and tested learning scenarios showcased. It is titled Healthy Snack and relates to engineering and technology as much as it does to healthy lifestyles. This unit, called Cooking with Local Produce Family Favourites, is during the research stage of the learning scenario. Here, students visit a local farmer allotment, go back to the classroom, view food manufacturing films, and visualize where missing ingredients are transported from by adding images and strings on a map and calculating distances. They then prepare and cook their favorite family dishes. Within each unit, you can find resources, what preparation is needed, and what students learn from carrying out the activity. It's easy to see the characteristics of open schooling, combining purpose in dealing with local community locations and collaboration in working with experts and families. We're now going to look at a learning unit from How Clean Is Our Air? This lesson is titled How Can Filters Help With Pollution? And it's during the create stage of the learning scenario. Here students mix powders and larger grains together. Then they try to separate them using different filters. They collect data and analyze factors which affect successful filtration. In Can I Find Filters in My School? The students will go on a treasure hunt around the school looking for different filters that are already in place. They will then examine different face masks and hear from a construction industry visitor who will talk about wearing masks in the workplace. For example, for safety, fumes, or for COVID. Here we see open schooling characteristics purpose in dealing with chemistry, real life issues, and the environment of the school, and collaboration in working with professional experts. All of the learning scenarios can be found on the Open Schooling Navigator and have full lesson plans. They have been co-designed by teachers and tested in more than one country. The Navigator is not just about showcasing these examples, it's also about building your own programmes, whether that's by taking a learning scenario and adapting it to suit your needs, or by building new programmes from scratch using the editing tool. Either way, by navigating to the Build Your Own section of the website, you can have access to a suite of tools. One thing to note is that you don't need to log in to use the Navigator and your work is saved by generating a shareable version. That way you can share with colleagues, lock a version which you can return to later, or send it to us at the Make It Open team as we're very interested in how you get on and in supporting your work. When using the Navigator, remember to browse and to adapt, to build and then to share your programme. You can find a link to the Open Schooling Navigator below and we really hope that you take full advantage. The next film is number five and the last of our How to Open School series. We'll be looking at the benefits of making this journey, what this means for your school, for you as a teacher, for your students and for your wider community. We hope to see you there.